Welcome to Runner's Journal. Hi, I'm Colleen. I'm a certified yoga teacher and a longtime runner. I teach yoga at Shanti Yoga Studio in Hopkinton, Mass. As a runner, I know how important my yoga practice is to my overall performance. That is why I, along with my two friends, Carly Fouth and Mary Pratt, who are also runners and yoga teachers, have put together this three-part series, Yoga for Runners. We created this three-part yoga series to help you before and after your training runs or for any kind of cross-training you do. Part one is designed to warm up your muscles before you head off onto your run. This section is about 15 minutes. It is short and sweet to get your body and mind ready to go. Part two is a post-run stretch. This part of training is often skipped and probably one of the most important things you can do for your body to stay healthy throughout your weeks, months of training. Part three is a body scan meditation to help with or teach you the mind-body connection. Meditation, like training, takes practice and repetition. This 20-minute meditation can be done anytime, after a long run, before bed, or at the start of your day. Carly, Mary, and I hope you use these videos to help you run the best and feel the best you can on Marathon Monday. Good luck. Hello, welcome to Runner's Journal, Episode 3. My name is Mary Pratt. Today we are going to do a body scan meditation. So you'll need to be on the floor like Colleen is here. And oftentimes it's nice to have something under your knees. So if you're home, maybe a rolled blanket or rolled towel, just place it under your knees. It eases your hamstrings and low back. Um, you can also place something under your head if that's more comfortable as well. So get your body settled in the body, um, on the mat for the meditation. And as you lay down, bring a soft closure to, you, to your eyes. And as you get settled here, simply notice the back of your head on the mat, your shoulders, your hips, your heels. Really feel the landing of your body. Allow yourself to settle into the ground. And then from here, just simply notice the breath in your body without necessarily changing the breath. Just feel where it arrives. Notice it leave your body. And then as you're here, simply take a breath in. Feel it land in your nose as you breathe in. Softly exhale through your mouth. Do that one more time, just breathing in through your nose. Exhale through your mouth. And from here, bring your attention to your right toes. Without moving them, just scan your big toe all the way to your pinky toes, just bringing your attention to that area. And then from here, bring your attention down the bottom of your foot into your heel. And feel the soft placement of your heel on the ground. And all we have to do is continue to just land in these spots, as I call them, remaining in a natural breath, feeling relaxation, in your body. And then 
from your right heel. Just feel your calf on the ground or slightly lifted. And actually like recognize the relaxation in your muscles. Notice if you're still holding and try and just let yourself loosen a little bit more. And bring your attention to your knee, your right knee. And feel the support of the block or the blanket. The softness of the bend. And then follow into your right hamstring. And as we did in the, just like the calf, just notice if you're still trying to utilize the muscle. And allow yourself to loosen the grip. Allow the restoration to take place. Bring your attention to your left toes. And as we did on the right side, just notice the big toe to your pinky toe, just scanning one by one. Follow the energy down the bottom of your foot, just feeling the lightness in that space at this moment. Into your heel, just supported. And then energy into your calf, just bring your attention there. And once again, just allowing a bit of ease and tenderness to come in. Bring your attention to your left knee. Feel the slight bend and support. And then into your left hamstring and Feel the softness, the tenderness, maybe even relaxation in that area. And then from here, just recognize your hips on the ground. Just feel the ground underneath you and let your hips settle in just a bit more. And from here, just wrap yourself around your whole pelvic area. So feeling the groundedness in front. Just notice your right hip and lower abdomen, left hip, back down to the mat. And as you're here, just notice yourself in your breath. And is it possible to take a breath in from this lower abdomen space? Let it be a long, slow inhale. And 
and a long, slow exhale all the way back to this lower abdomen. Do that two more times, just feeling it from your lower abdomen between your hip bones. Linger up into your nostrils. Softly exhale, let it land back in the lower belly. One more time here. As you're here, just feel yourself just for a moment, just your whole self. Feel the ground underneath you. The softness of your breath. the relaxation in your body, the restoration that's taking place. Just coming back to <clears throat> the back of your hips, the center of your tailbone where your spine begins at the sacrum and just follow the line of your spine all the way up to the back of your head. And as you follow this line, imagine each vertebrae, all the nerves, just imagine the energy used from this space in your body, the length that it helps create as we're running. Let yourself just relax from your hips all the way up to the back of your head. Let all those little muscles that hold us up relax a bit more. From here, wrap your attention to your abdomen above your belly button. And notice as you breathe in, just notice the diaphragm, the muscle that presses down into your lower belly, just creating the breath as you breathe in. Softly exhale and notice the diaphragm come back up. Take two more breaths, just becoming aware of this gentle movement. Long exhale. One more time through. From here, bring your attention into heart center. <clears throat> and we'll start feeling just the space across our chest. And just the openness as we're laying on the floor and just support of the floor underneath us. Feel your shoulder blades on the ground. And the center of your chest between your shoulder blades. And for a few moments, taking the attention just to the center of your heart. 
So not in the front of your chest, not on your spine, but just that center space within. And as you take a breath, feel the fullness across your chest into your collarbone. And then release, exhale. Do that two more times, just breathing in, feeling that breath start from the center of our body, expanding out. And then exhale, let it land and release. One more time. Exhale. And just bring your attention to your shoulders. Feel them grounded. And then notice your arms, how they're placed. Tension down into your hands. Coming to your right hand, feel from your thumb to your pinky. And just notice the placement of your hands, whether they're face up or face down. the ease of not gripping. And then bring your attention to your left hand and the same thing, just imagine from the thumb to the pinky. Notice the placement, notice the ease. stream up through your neck into your jaw letting there be space between your teeth tongue released if it's gripping softness of breath through your lips Feel the tension up your cheeks, into your eyelids. Notice the softness of the closure, the gentleness across your eyebrows. Feel the space across your forehead. And bring your attention to the back of your head. And just feel the rest, the rest that you feel there. you're here, take a scan all the way down the front of your body, just feeling it from the crown of your head down to your toes. And rest the front of your body a little more into the back side of your body. Just release a little more down.
Feel the back of your body, from the back of your head to your shoulders, hips, heels. Really feel the mat underneath you. Feel the support that you have. Feel your wholeness in this space. Connection from your feet all the way up to your head. The breath in your body. breath in here. Softly exhale. And you're welcome to stay as long as you feel needed. Namaste.